at Sculpin. Woo! Double! <laughs> Yoo -hoo. How do you like that? How do you like that? Double Sculpin. Hey, what's going on, guys? Um, I spent the night here on the Oregon coast. We picked a beautiful day out here. Um, pretty calm. It's like an hour and a half before high tide. And um, just call me the Sculpin Killer. Man, I even had a double. Has anybody had a double Sculpin on, on, on a, a pole trying to go for a perch? I don't think so. It takes skill. It takes skill. But anyways, I'm out here. Um, we're going to do some crabbing. Hopefully we'll get some to take home. And uh, let's, let's give it a go. First of all, guys, I wanted to let you know I will do a random giveaway of two of my custom crab snares made by me. I have recently hit a thousand subscribers, and thanks to you guys, this really means a lot to me. Without your help, I could never achieve this myself. Here's the criteria, guys. You must be a subscriber. That's one. Two, you must make a comment on this video I am entering in the crab snare giveaway. Three, the deadline is going to be September 30th. And the next day, I will select a random winner and mail out to a U.S. address only a week after. But you have to acknowledge and say you want the crab snare. All right. Thanks again. And let's get on to our little adventure. All right, guys, we got our uh, crab snare loaded up. Ready to rock and roll. We got a little bit of salmon on there and squid. It's like one of my favorite baits. All right, let's go toss this. All right, guys, now that we're set up, it's been like uh, maybe a little less than 10 minutes. Let's uh, give it a pull. All right, you wanna tighten down the uh, really in the slack. Just get a feel for it. Got a lot of line out there. Uh, I feel pretty uh, heavy, and this pull. Oh, that's really. Uh, looks like uh, I have a small crab. Uh. Oh, we don't want to go there. Uh. All right, first one is a female crab. Female crab right there, you can see. Right on the arm. All right, buddy young lady let's get you off uh, here female we don't keep females off you go all right that's how to do it all right let's throw this out again all right right there Put it back in our holder. Perfect. And I got my uh, perch set up actually. Just gonna toss it right in front. Yeah, we we'll just flip this out there and see, see what happens. Swing it. Underhand it. There you go. Right there. Let's see if there's any perch around. I got the sand. Oh, I'm getting bites already. Oh, yeah. That's pretty good. Ooh. 
Oh, that's really sh that's shallow right there. Mm. Oh, they're going after. Oh, that's only about. Oh, come on, baby. Let's take it. Woo! This is pretty exciting. Okay. There are perch around here or something. Just a little experiment. That's only about three feet right there. If that. Oh, I'm getting bit. Come on, baby. They're lively, these guys. Oh, fish on, baby. Fish on. There it goes. Oh, yeah. Yeah. No skunk for the weekend. How you like that? On the Berkeley sandworm. All right. Let's go. All right. Got one. Got one. Went for that Berkeley sandworm. Oh, shoot. All right, that's a barb, barb perch. I don't think that's uh, big enough to keep. All right, guys, here we go. Let's try to catch another one. Another perch, let's go. Let's try this side. Right here is good. Try it out. New bait. All right, here we go. No takers yet. There you go, I'm getting bites now. They're just right there. It's like a two feet of water. There it goes, another one. Oh yeah, oh shoot! What the hell is that? Holy crap! Wow! Are you kidding me? What? Oh my God! Holy, was that a salmon? Oh my God. I gotta see that on the replay. Gee whiz, that was just all white. Oh my God. That was crazy. Oh my God, maybe I should throw spinners over here. That is crazy. But how would you land your uh, fish? If you uh, hooked onto a salmon over here, crazy. Oh my God. Woo, that was exciting. Oh my God. Wow. Man, I can't 
I, I can't get that out of my mind. What was that? Had to be a salmon. I hope I have. Uh, I can zoom in on that. All right, let's hop up here. Grab the crab snare. I don't even know how how uh, long it's been in there now. I'm just so excited to deal with the uh, the perch. I'm just so excited about um, the action that I'm getting, the bites of the perch. All right, here we go. All right, got a passenger. You gotta keep keep it tight all the time. I got two. Oh, dang! I had two, but I think the other one was a female. Yeah, I think my buddy was right. Um, this time of year, there's a lot more females in this area so I mean it's still pretty early it's the uh, last part of August yeah let's see uh, uh, yeah still pretty soft I can feel that all right off you go all right guys uh, I think I'm gonna look I think I'm gonna go perch fishing off the surf and cut it I'm kind of getting excited here, um, getting all this action. Maybe I try some uh, surf fishing. All right, guys, just got done with lunch, and um, I got some energy left. Um, all excited about that jetty fishing we're gonna go surf perch fishing for uh, maybe an hour or so all righty let's let's check it out all right guys here we go let's see if we could actually catch a surf perch not from the jetty This is a little sandbar over here. I remember from the other day. All right, a little shallow here. Just gotta remember. All right, let's give it a first cast. Let's see what's up. Ooh, fish on baby oh yeah heck yeah oh that was a instant first cast guys I don't know how big this is but I'm pretty happy feels like a small one oh yeah yo baby oh yeah look at that thing fight Yee! Oh yeah. All right. Whoops. Right on the lip. Nice hook set. Do we want to keep this? Nah. Let's let's uh let him go. Let him go. Uh uh. Oh. I, dang. I forgot my uh my pliers. 
swim in the water. That, was that exciting? Is the day exciting? Oh my God. Um, so I just got a cannonball uh, sinker here. It's um, two ounces and into a uh, Berkeley gulp sandworm. I got two of them, one on the top there. And I went with a little heavier rod because that way I can cast it a little farther. But first cast, uh, it, that's pretty awesome. All right, second cast, guys. I'm almost casting to that last wave, that last breaker. That fish was just waiting for me. Fish on. There we go. All right. I think this uh, might be a little bit heavier. Woo! -hoo! All right. It's fighting pretty good. Just back up a little bit. There it is. Surfing. Oop, oop, oop. All right, about the same size as the other one. All right. They hit it. Boy, they really hit this. They really hammer it. Nice. All right. We caught fish number two. We're casting uh, pretty far out there. I guess we're casting that far out because this, this um, beach is really level. Oh, there's a seal right there in front of me. Probably catching some perch. That's not a good sign. Well, it's a good sign that there's probably fish around. There he is. Yeah, chasing all that, all that perch. Yeah, you found the hole, didn't you? Hopefully those fish just kind of scatter and, and go back into school again. Fish on, baby. There it is. All right. That was a seal bite. You know, pushing all the fish closer to shore. Right on. Thank you, Mr. Seal. All right, let's back up.
Yeah, the perch are not very big. But... Alright. Let's uh, put this guy in the bucket. I just casted it. I heaved it out there. It's far. Now just wait. There goes fish on fish on baby there is in a little hole right here i'm just just to the right of the hole all right this is the fourth fish there it is they're about the same size. I'm probably just gonna let this go. Yeah, this is a little longer, but um, yeah. Let this guy go. All right, we'll let this, oh, whoa, 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 where are you going? Yeah, I'm trying to get you off. There you go. There you go. Hopefully I didn't damage my worm. Still good. All right, the other one's chewed up. All right, here we go. Woo! Bam, that's way out there. First breaker. Or the second to the... Well, yeah, that's almost the first breaker. That's what's uh, working for me right now. So I'm not going to change. Getting bites. I'm still on it. I got him. I got him. It's a small, I think it's a small one. They're all averaging about eight, eight inches or something like that. Yeah, this is a really small one. Did he get my... Uh... Don't want to get my reel wet. That's the smallest one today. But he swallowed that baby. Come on, man. There we go. You're free. Yeah, well, it's still around. This is fun. Love this. You can see the, the foam guys 
see how it's moving right to the left look at the foam so you know anything you learn about reading the river is probably the same about the, uh, it's probably the same like the ocean so fish are not going to be in the uh, strong current but they're going to be in the troughs of uh, like in that sand sandbar channels so maybe find a place that it might be not ripping so so bad all right fish on oh yeah so it was uh, ripping left uh, right to left and it ended up in that little hole where you see it's nice and calm right there and yeah the fish hit it so maybe they're just sitting right there that's the least path of resistance all right oh i'll keep this one this is a uh, a bigger one yeah i'll keep that all right all right guys that is our perch that we uh, caught today i'm only keeping four uh, i caught about a half dozen or something like that and, and lost quite a few but today was uh, a very exciting and fun day for me and i finally landed a surf perch all right guys i'm gonna just uh clean the fish Gonna go to the uh, anus part. I remember when I was uh, younger, when I used to clean these fish, um, they really had a uh, smell to them. Um, watch out for their spines, and they have like the inside of them is black I remember yeah there's a lot of blood anyways uh, let's see if I can just cut this uh, these spines over here because it's really it's sharp so basically uh, I'm just gonna yeah, I'm not, I'm not going to be lazy. Just cut it like that. All the way through. And then just rip it out. Just like that. I haven't tasted um, perch in, I don't know, probably 30 years. I haven't really gone after them. Now, see that area right there? That's what I remember, that black on the sides. So, yeah. Yeah, just we're gonna clean it real quick. Oh, this guy. Oh, okay, that's not. I thought that was like little eggs, but that's by his gill. Yeah. Then we're just gonna rinse them out. Rinse it out with water. Take all that gunk out of the spine. The bloodline or something like that. Yeah, and then we're just going to fry this up later. So let's continue to wash this. Alright. Just like that. Perfect. It's nice and clean now. Ready to put on the frying pan. You know, I like to clean mine really well, so. Alright, alright, just like that.
we'll um we'll clean the others okay we'll do the same thing for the others i think this guy's out already yep but yeah we'll uh continue to do that what if uh, we do it like like this this would be the lazy way i guess right and then throw the head like that and then from the anus just cut it out and then clean it stick your finger in there and then just clean it that's fast that's a faster way to do it you know like that and we'll just rinse it out in this uh, bucket of water right here Here's the bucket of water where I'm rinsing it. Right in there. Yep, hard to do this with one hand, but you get the drift. Okay, that's two. All right, that's two clean. All right, let's uh, do the rest. All right, so on this video, guys, I'm gonna figure out how to give away um, those two crab snares so please make a comment and then in those comments i'm just gonna select one random person um, and then that person has to actually acknowledge that they want the crab snares all right all right guys just like what my dad says service unto others is the pay your rent here on earth all right laters Out of here, guys. Four wheel drive. Thank God. Here it goes. Yeah, I remember. It's a good tasting fish. It's, um, it's not flaky, but it's a little bit on the tender side, like the soft side, not mushy. It's not like salmon, but it's got great flavor. That's really good. Try a little bit of uh, lime on here, or I mean lemon. See how that adds the flavor. I'm not even bothering to using the sausage it's really good yeah that's really natural it's natural really good mm. <clears throat> very good all right let's try this um like a the filipino sauce here That's usually my go-to. I mean, this is the sauce. I can remember this is the only sauce that I ate with any fish or even poultry or, or meat, just an all-around sauce. All right, here it goes. Mm, it brings a smile to my face. Super good. I can probably eat like 
three of these in one sitting.